Gotta go see mom and then come back. What? Cut that out. To today's episode on fit vegan life. I've coached Candy, we got Coach David behind the camera, and today we're in our kitchen. Today we're featuring Chef Jessica <laughs> from Cabaz Catering. Uh, Chef Jessica, what did you bring today? Uh, well, we're doing no chips, or no, sorry, no baked chocolate chips, protein bars, and they're super good and really good for you, and I'm super excited to be in your kitchen today. Let's go, Jessica. Jessica inspired me. She actually has given us many samples of these bars before, and I'm like, Jessica, we need you on our channel. So if you are interested in any of her recipes or check it out for stuff, you can see her at Cabez Catering on Instagram. But today, let's dive deep into our recipe. It's simple, won't take long, but let's start with our first step. So we got oatmeal. Oatmeal, we're going with the gluten-free only oats. We're gonna add a cup to our mixing bowl, and that's gonna be our starting point. Next up, we got, ooh, we got ghost protein. We're trying out a new one today from Supplement King. It's called Pancake Batter. Ooh, look at Doesn't that. that. smell good? Mm. I've never seen a scoop like that. <laughs> <laughs> and the scoop was on top. Nice. <laughs> Let's go one scoop. Perfect, we'll give that a little mix around. So that is it for our dry ingredients. So next up, what are we gonna add, Jessica? So now we have our liquids. Uh, we have agave right here in the top, and then we have almond butter right here in the bottom. So it's here. How much are we? We got a half a cup. So sorry, half a cup of almond butter and half a cup of the agave. Nice. And we're, are we gonna put a recipe in the description? Yes, it's right there. <laughs> <laughs> so just, I was telling Coach Candy and Coach David that if this is my base for the bar, so we can always change it up. Like it doesn't have to be almond, almond butter, it could be cashew butter, it could be any butter. Peanut butter. As long as it's, it's good and it fits into your macros. Same with like your oats, it doesn't have to be gluten-free oats if you want all the gluten. <laughs> Go for it. Get the non-gluten-free. <laughs> and I know there's sometimes where like people get sick of a specific protein so you don't have to go with pancake butter all the time you can have vanilla, chocolate, whatever you fancy. Love all it. You. Love it. Super customizable. Mm -hmm. Love it. So next up we gotta add the chocolate chips, which we got these ones. I think you've been by the hell. Show us a bag. And here, enjoy life. And uh, why do we use those on canvas? They are vegan. So absolutely no dairy. Mm -hmm. It only has three ingredients. It has cocoa mass, brown sugar, and cocoa butter. Sweet. Perfect. Keep so we just ball. put the whole bag in there? Or? <laughs> no. You know, we need a, uh, a like quarter cup. One cup. One cup. Ooh, okay, that's a lot. So that's good. One cup of chocolate chips. So if you want to make these bars uh, lower on the calorie side or even on the fat side, you could do less chocolate chips. Again, the recipe is very versatile. So we're gonna add in the chocolate chips. I think we might have added some milk as well. Yes. Yeah. Because this is looking a little Question, question yeah. for the bros, and I might, we might get this one in the comments, is like, could you add more protein to this recipe? You can add more protein, but you would just uh, equalize it with your liquid that we're gonna add for the milk. So uh, it's like one scoop of protein powder, and then it's 60 ml of almond milk. So if you were to put two scoops, it would be 120 ml of almond milk or whatever liquid of choice that you want. Just to get the consistency yeah. right? Yes. Awesome. Yeah. Oh, they smell delicious. And also, if, if you do have milk, for example, in your protein powder. Um, this one doesn't have milk in it because it's a vegan one. So it may not need any liquid because it, it doesn't need the milk to kind of it together. Yeah, equal it out. So nice. that's it. That Beautiful. is it. That's now it. we're that's gonna only spread them out in a little pan and we don't need to put it in the baking sheet because it's not going in the oven. So 
So we're gonna spread them out on the pan. We actually didn't need any milk for it because everything, look at that, it's like a big cookie dough ball. Mm -hmm. Sweet. Doesn't that look delicious? It looks it. great. <laughs> right now. <laughs> Oh yeah, that agave wow. is good. All right, let's press it into the pan. Do you have any tricks for this, Jessica? Uh, you do, yeah, I'm doing one. Just like this? Okay. All right, just checking to see if I miss not any of these chef tips. Okay. How, did, how did you come up with this bar, Jessica? Um, I found, like I, when I, was, when I was doing meal plans and trying to customize things for myself to make myself want to eat healthier, um, I just researched uh, protein bars, and every single one always would have oats, butter, protein, and any kind of like sugar like this. And so I was like, okay, well, if it's the same thing for everything, and I try um, the measurements, I'm like, yeah, you can just customize it. Like I would do green tea or with matcha. There's a lot of like the people that I talk to are always like, oh, we want like out of the box flavors or like um, hube, which is like a Filipino yam. Yeah, mm -hmm. It has more sugar than regular sweet potato, but it's still pretty healthy for you. So I incorporated that and that's one of the girls that I work out with. She's obsessed with it. <laughs> Her name is May. Shout out May. <laughs> <laughs> so All right, this press don't really get in the pan. So now what do we do with it from here? So right here we could just Cover it, put it in the freezer um, to make it hard, <laughs> and then you'll, you'll be able to divvy it up into bars and then eat it and enjoy. Ta da! <laughs> the bars are done. We took them out of the freezer, we got them on a plate. I just want to send a huge shout out to Jessica from Kabaz Catering. She provided us with this recipe. She came over here, she showed us exactly how to make it. So I hope you guys. Follow along with our video and give these bars a try. Now it's time to taste test. Eva, are you ready? I'm so ready. Oh, everybody gets a bar here. Oh my god. Mm. Oh, so good. So good. <laughs> Go ahead. Put that in there. Put that in there. Sorry. No, no, it's okay. I'm fine. No, eat it. Eat it, Paul. <laughs> you can come back and have more later. All right. So, so good. Oh, so good. All right, thank yeah, you. Your brother's just awesome. stealing off the plate. So, <laughs> big shout out to these ladies for making these awesome bars. See you guys in the next video. Until then, like, comment, and subscribe.